Clovenier Stolen, Amsterdam. The Clovenier Stolen Musketeers shooting range was a complex of buildings in Amsterdam which served as headquarters and shooting range for the local Shutterage Civic Guard. The companies of Cloveniers were armed with an early type of musket known as an arquebus, known in Dutch as a bus, hakbis or clover from the French couleuvrine, hence the name Cloveniers. The Clovenier Stolen was located at the corner of Nieuw Dolenstraat and Clovenier Spurgel Canal, both named after the former shooting range. The 19th century Dolan Hotel now stands on the spot. Two Cloveniers are depicted on the domed tower of the hotel, another reference to the history of this location. Rembrandt's painting The Night Watch was commissioned for the Great Hall of the Clovenier Stolen. History The Clovenier Stolen was one of three Dolan's shooting ranges for the Amsterdam Shutterage Civic Guard. The other two shooting ranges were the Handboog Dolan and Voteboog Dolan, both located along the Singel. The Handboog Dolan Civic Guard was armed with longbows, while the Voteboog Dolan Civic Guard wielded crossbows, and the Clovenier Stolen Civic Guard used an early type of musket, the Arquebus. The Clovenier Stolen was the oldest of the three. Amsterdam's militia guilds were formed in the Middle Ages to defend the city against attack. Around 1580, at the behest of William of Orange, these medieval guilds were incorporated into a new, much larger civic guard to defend the newly Protestant city against the Spanish during the Dutch Revolt, which ultimately led to a full-blown war of independence, the Eighty Years' War. Officers of this new civic guard were recruited from the well-to-do of Amsterdam. The original building for the Cloveniers Guild was constructed in 1382 and stood along what is now Oud Dolenstraat, east of Dam Square. In 1520 it was replaced with a new building on Nieuw Dolenstraat, adjacent to a defensive tower in the city walls known as Swijch Utrecht Be Quiet Utrecht as its primarily role had been to defend the city against attacks by the bishopric of Utrecht. In 1638, a lavish new addition to the Clovenier Stolen was completed. The new building was very modern for its time rectangularly shaped, and in the classicist style, that was very fashionable at that time. On the first floor of this new wing was a banquet hall measuring 18 by 9 meters. The elegant hall so impressed visitors that some compared it to the banqueting house in London. In the mid-17th century, the Eighty Years' War ended, and the Civic Guard no longer served a military purpose. The Civic Guard continued to exist, but membership became an honorary position, and the Dolans assumed a primarily social function. The wealthiest and most powerful citizens of Dutch Golden Age Amsterdam came together in the Dolans to eat, drink, and smoke. The elegant building was also used for official receptions and dinners, and to provide lodgings to prominent visitors to Amsterdam. Marie de Medici and Tsar Peter the Great viewed a fireworks display on the Amstel River from a window of the Clovenier Stolen. On 7 and 9 August 1748, the Great Hall hosted public gatherings of the Dolison, a local protest group of mostly merchants opposing the perceived nepotism of the well-to-do who dominated Amsterdam's city government. The crowds that gathered in the hall were so large, some feared that the floor would collapse under the weight. In 1882-1883, the entire complex was demolished and replaced by the Dolan Hotel, which still stands on this location. Painting The walls of the Clovenier Stolen were decorated with group portraits of the different companies of the Civic Guard. As early as 1529, Dirk Jacobs painted a group portrait of a rot company of the Cloveniers Civic Guard. It may have been the first group painting of the Civic Guard ever commissioned. The painting is now in the Rakes Museum. The best known of these group portraits for the Clovenier Stolen is Rembrandt's The Night Watch. Completed in 1642, it was commissioned by the Clovenier Company under the command of Franz Banning Koch. 
Other painters commissioned to do group portraits for the Great Hall of the Clovinier Stolen were Nicolaes Ilias, Picanoi Govert Flink, Bartholomeus van der Helst, Jacob Adrienes, Backer, and Joachim von Sandrart. From about 1683, the group portraits were removed from the Dolans. Most were hung in Amsterdam's City Hall on Dam Square, now the Royal Palace of Amsterdam, others sold at auction. Many of the paintings were significantly trimmed to fit their new home. The full-size versions are known only through copies made of the original paintings, such as the watercolor copies contained in the Edgerton Manuscript, which is now in the British Library. The night watch was trimmed on all four sides when it was moved to the town hall in 1715, presumably to fit the painting between two columns. This alteration resulted in the loss of two characters on the left side of the painting, as well as the top of the arch, the balustrade, and the edge of the step. This balustrade and step were key visual tools used by Rembrandt to give the painting a forward motion. A 17th-century copy of the painting by Jarrett London's at the National Gallery. London shows the original composition. Related Buildings The Clovenier Stolen was one of three Dolan's shooting ranges for the Amsterdam Civic Guard, alongside the Handboog Dolan and Voteboog Dolan, both located along Singel Canal. Of the three, only the Handboog Dolan survives. The location of the Clovenier Stolen is now occupied by the 19th century Dolan Hotel. The Neo Renaissance building contains some of the original walls and foundations of the Clovenier Stolen. Two Cloveniers are depicted on the domed tower of the hotel. They originally held muskets, but these have gone missing. Other Dutch towns, including Middelburg, Harlem, and Dordrecht, also had a Clovenier Stolen equals equals references equals equals